In this video I'm going to show you how to make a chicken stir fry. I'm starting by preparing my spices, my aromatics. So I'm going to peel my ginger with a spoon and then finely chop it. Uh, you could also grate it. I'm going to crush my garlic, peel it and then finely chop it. and then de-seeding the chilli and slicing it. Make sure that you wash your hands with soap and water after you have touched chilli, otherwise there is that possibility that it will burn your um, eyes or nose or mouth if you touch it. Next I'm preparing my veg. Make sure that you have washed your vegetables first or wiped it if it's using the mushrooms. Um, I'm using noodles so I'm gonna go for a long and thin in shape. If you're using rice, you would probably want to have chunks um, but try and get them so that they're all a similar shape and size and remember to use your bridge and claw when preparing. Prepare your raw meat on a separate board to prevent any cross-contamination of um, transfer of bacteria. And try and cut across the grain so that you get tender pieces of meat, making sure that they're all similar in size so that they cook evenly. Once you've finished handling raw meat, make sure that you wash your hands with soap and water. Fill a saucepan half full with water and bring to the boil. Put a dessert spoonful of oil into a frying pan and add in your aromatics, your ginger, your garlic, your chilli, and then um, heat or fry on a high heat for briefly to release those flavours. And then you need to add in your chicken and you're gonna stir fry it until it's white. And then once that's happened, add in your harder veg like your carrots uh, first as they take a bit longer to cook and then cook your noodles to the packet instructions so mine was for about four minutes keep them on the move and then once they've started to release their juices a little bit add the rest of the vegetables and cook for around three minutes need to drain your new noodles through a colander over the sink. Once they are to the texture that you want them, add the sauce ingredients and stir through and then stir into your veg for about a minute before serving. 